Hello, my Aries. My name is Psychic Gigi. I'm going to be doing a mini general love reading. Again, this is a mini general love reading just to kind of give you guys um, an update for January 1st through January 15th, 2020. Happy New Year's, everyone. Um, we're going to go ahead and start right into our reading with a Romance Oracle Angel card to see what our spirit guides want us or need us to know. So there's definitely, um, I always find that there's um, very positive messages within this. Okay, so the first one is keep an open mind. Your soulmate may differ from the usual type and expectations. Just kind of show you up front. So, um, a lot of you might be specifically looking for a certain body type or a certain person, and it just might not be that person. So, have an open mind and open heart. I do tell people that all the time um, because it's not necessarily um, the person that we would expect, but it would be the right person. So, that's very important for you guys to know. Okay, let's go ahead and jump right into our reading and see what our tarot cards want to say for our Aries, Sun, Moon, and Rising, as well as our Cross Watchers. Okay, so the first card that I have is the Eight of Pentacles. Um, I feel like a lot of you have been very patient. Um, you're waiting to reap the rewards of your efforts and around your relationship. Um, the next card I have is the temperance, which is being balanced and sensible. Some of you are actually going to meet somebody new. Um, as I'm resonating with your reading, you're going to meet somebody new. And this person can be very exciting, very fun, very spontaneous, type of free-spirited type of energy. And it does come in quick and fast. So, again, keep an open mind. Um, I do, I got the page of wands, so there's going to be, um, a lot of communication in regards to your love in the area of romance, so I feel like there's going to be some communication going on, and this might throw you off balance a little bit because I have the two of pentacles, so you need to be able to juggle, um, not only just work, but, you know, go out, have some fun. Be balanced, be sensible. You guys are already in control of your situation. Um, and it, even if you don't feel control, you're going to start taking back control in around relationships. Um, I do feel like some of you have a, um, a person around you, but they tend to um, be a little bit sharp with their tongue and I don't think I don't feel like you guys are taking it very personally because you are balanced you're sensible you want to go out you want to have fun and I feel like the first two weeks of January you guys are going to be kind of still in that celebration mode where um, you're not really focused too much on this person you're more so doing self-evaluation exact um, um, with yourself and exactly what you want in around a relationship. If you are waiting from somebody from your past to come back, because I do feel like someone from your past will come back, there is going to be some delays. So just kind of um, be patient. Um, but at the same time, I you know, don't limit your options. Um, this person has caused you um, some emotional distress. It They might even have caused you um, tears, like anxiety. Um, you don't understand them. You feel like there's a lack of clarity in around them. Um, but you're letting go of that fear and for January 1st to January 15, 2020, I feel like some of you are going to be keeping an open mind, an open heart, and you're going to see what your other options are out there for you. Um, because what this person has given you in the past has not been fulfilling towards you. 
So there's definitely some um, decision make making that you guys are going to be going through there. Um, some of you are going to be walking away from a situation in search of something new. But there is a light at the end of the tunnel for you guys. So I do feel like some of you are going to be having some new love come in. Okay, guys, please like, share, and subscribe. If you'd like a personal, more in-depth reading with me, my information is listed below. Again, I, I just want to wish you all a happy new year as well as um, happy holidays. Please like, share, and subscribe. And again, if you want a more personal, in-depth reading towards your situation, um, please contact me. My information is listed below. Love and light and happy holidays to everyone.